do that uh, just head along to the website or if, to be honest it might be easiest to just put it into a search engine um, but you can of course go to the website um, bbc.co.uk slash upload and put uh, your content there someone who did that is Stuart Green a school teacher and musician from Sutton because he can't sing in care homes as he would normally be doing he's been doing online concerts instead and now he's working with his Ely singing group to raise money for charity hello Stuart it. Good evening, Fadis. How are you? I'm all right. How are you doing? Oh, well, after that build-up, I'm quite excited myself now. <laughs> I should have had a honest. drum roll. <laughs> Sadly, I don't have a, a drum roll on a button. I do have this. <laughs> it's probably not quite the introductory sound you were after. I'm not sure what that was, but... Yeah. <laughs> it's a goat! <laughs> We, oh, it? we okay. stole that from the reports coming out of Wales of the goats taking oh, over right, the yeah. small Welsh yeah. town. It's now my yeah. new favourite sound effect, but I'm glad I didn't use it in your introduction because it, it <laughs> wouldn't have been appropriate. So, Stuart, your group is called I'll Have a Shanty. Well, two things. One, it's not my group, it's our group, <laughs> and that's very important. Um, we are a collective. And um, it's interesting because down here in Cambridgeshire, everyone seems to add the H in the middle of the word. I'll have a shanty. It's very, very well spoken. <laughs> but obviously being a shanty band and being more sea orientated and pirate orientated, it's I'll have a shanty. It does sound no better when you say it. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me about how the group came together, the group that is not your group, but a collective group. <laughs> so the six of us are, are all good mates and we all... Um, essentially met in a choir that we used to sing in together, um, although some of us have known each other longer. And um, one day, in one of the members' gardens, we just decided to start messing about with sea shanties, and um, we practised a few, and then we came together for a few rehearsals, just, again, just for fun and a beer and a bit of a laugh. And um, then we got a gig, and we did the gig, and off the back of that gig, we got another gig and another gig, and the momentum built, and uh, we found ourselves... In January, in Sue Marchant's studio, in Nicky Chapman's studio, with the uh, with the folk show, and did a session for them. And off the back of that, we got even more gigs, and then they've all been cancelled. Yeah. <laughs> so, ha have you ever performed together? Then? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you have. Good. I was going to say. Yeah. I hope you I hope you haven't had all your gigs cancelled before you even got the chance. To. No. We, well, we say so we had we'd done about seven or eight gigs, I okay. think, up to um, February. The last one we did was a big, big fundraiser for Sutton Scouts. Um, and then say one by one, um, for reasons that are obvious, they've been kind yeah. of chopped off the schedule for now. Um, H are you missing it? How are you oh, coping yeah. as a group and are you trying to rehearse? Well, we started, we thought we'll rehearse and then we thought we'll go busking and then one by one with the social distancing and, yeah. and not being allowed in the same room and various other things became more difficult. Um, so we've met together on social media and uh, tried to sing there as well. But of course, there's a time lag, which makes it very difficult when there's six of you. Um, so in the end, we got together and, and did what we've done, which you're about to play soon, I believe. Yeah, I'm going to play it in a little bit um, and everyone's going to enjoy it. It's, it's great, actually, with something like Shanty singing that immediately you get a great mental is not an image you know a mental sound a memory of the shanties that you'll have heard yeah. and maybe me more than others because i come from norfolk so oh, you've well, got that go. yeah no, well, shanty I mean, heritage shanties and, and sea songs i mean they're great fun aren't they and uh, you know the whole idea of our act and the whole ethos of our act is, is interacting with our audience and getting everyone singing along with us and although some of them are, are very well known lots of them aren't but they all have you know really um tuneful refrains shall we say where everyone can join in quite easily um and clap along or sing along or dance along or whatever and it, it, that's that's the sort of ethos behind what we try to do and how we try to come across well let's hear this and chat a little bit more so okay. people have a really clear idea of what we're talking about so Stuart Green with us here on BBC Radio Cambridgeshire part of the group I'll have a shanty and uh, <laughs> doesn't sound as good as when you say it though Stuart and here is the last shanty oh, my father often told me when I was just a lad a sailor's life was very hard, the food was always bad. But now I've joined the Navy, a poor man of war. And now I find a sailor ain't a sailor anymore. Oh, go hold the rope, don't climb up the mast. If you see a sailing ship, it might be a last. Get your civvies ready for another run ashore. A sailor ain't a sailor ain't a sailor anymore. Well, the killer of our mess, he says we've had it soft. It wasn't like this in his day when he was up aloft. We like our bunks and sleeping bags, but what's a hammock for? 
Swinging from the deckhead, deckhead. Or lying on the floor Don't hold, hold on the rope Don't, don't climb up the mast If you see a sailing ship It might be your last Get your civvies ready For another run ashore A sailor ain't a sailor Ain't a sailor anymore Well they gave um, us an engine The post um, went up and down Done with more technology, the engine went around. Woo! We know our steam and diesel, but what's the main you're for? No, just... A stoker ain't a stoker, we're the trouble anymore. Don't, don't, don't hold on the rope, don't climb up the mast. If you see a sailing ship, it might be a lass. Get your civvies ready for another run ashore. A sailor ain't a sailor, ain't a sailor anymore. Well, they gave us all the slant so we can do it right. They gave us a radio, we sing all day and night. We know our codes and ciphers, but what's the sound of four? A bunting castle and a dust of nothing anymore. Don't haul on the road, don't climb up the mast. If you see a sailing ship, it might be a last. Get your civvies ready for another run ashore. A sailor ain't a sailor, ain't a sailor anymore. Two cans of beer a day. And then you bleed lots of Now we get an extra one because it's not the top. So we we'll put our CV clothes on and find a pub ashore. A sailor's still a sailor, just like Here we go! Don't haul on the rope, don't climb up the mast. If you see a sailing ship, it might be a last. Get your civvies ready for another run ashore. A sailor ain't a sailor, ain't a sailor anymore. One more time! Haul on the rope, don't climb up the mast. If you see a sailing ship, it might be a lass. Get your civvies ready for another run ashore. A sailor ain't a sailor, ain't a sailor anymore. Woo! Hey! <laughs> round of applause all round, Stuart. Um, it sounds like so much fun to sing. It's great fun. I don't think you've seen the video that goes with that, but that song has actions. <laughs> and uh, I've just found myself standing here doing all the actions, as I know the guys who are listening will be as well. And their families. I love all the whooping, all the woo! Um, and just general enjoyment that's happening while you're well, performing. That, that's probably to do with uh, the alcohol we were probably drinking <laughs> at the same time. But yeah, it's, it is. It's all fun. I mean, it, that's the thing. It's the joy of singing at the best of times, but the joy of singing those songs um, just adds that extra dimension, doesn't it? And this particular uh, track is 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 raising money for charity. Yeah, what we did, I mean, so we all um, we all sent our bits in to, to uh, Elliot C. Spray, who's uh, our technical <laughs> engineer, and uh, he pieced it all together in a video, and um, we thought we'd put it out there, and I thought, well, you know, the way the world is at the moment, everyone's suffering in one way or another, and charities, of course, are losing funding left, right, and centre for obvious reasons, so we thought we'd attach a couple of charity donation links onto the video, um, so we thought, well, we'll do a local one. Um, the Adden Addenbrooke's Charitable Trust being the choice. Um, and then the other one, of course, that's been associated with the sea, even though we're quite a long way from it over here, was the lifeboat, the RNLI, who do a fantastic service, of course, yeah. um, and need the funding to make that happen. And although they're not going to rescue anyone from the sea in Cambridge, it's still a very important service. Yeah, we all, most of us, go to the coast Indeed. at some point and um, not a summer goes by without some dreadful story from the, the coastline. So the RNLI, uh, yeah. such an important charity. Again, I'm probably speaking as a Norfolk girl there. <laughs> so, well, and and it's, so yeah, apt. It's, it's obvious, isn't it, with the charities too, that all the big fundraising events, the marathons and the runs and all all kinds of things that bring all this money in. Um, it's just off the radar right now, so every every penny helps. And what are your plans for post-lockdown? As a group, are you talking about what you're going to do when we're all released back into normality? <laughs> we can't wait till we're all released. It's going to be one <laughs> hell of a party. But, but yeah, I mean, we've got gigs right throughout the year. Um, I say that we're getting cancelled one by one. We're OK up at the moment to August. We've got gigs beyond them, which might or might not be on. But when the lockdown comes, we will be out there doing it. Although there is one um, we're going to be involved with in a couple of weeks, in May the 2nd. Um, we were due to play at the Haddenham Beer Festival, yeah. which is another event that's had to be pulled. Um, and they're putting together what they're calling a plugged-in show <laughs> for all the, um, the acts that we're going to be playing at the Beer Festival to do something on Saturday 2nd of May. And we're going to be part of that. And I can't quite tell you what it is yet we're doing because that's a bit of a secret, but we're definitely <laughs> oh. involved. Well, that sounds great. Uh, and alongside all of this, I've got it written down that you're a school teacher. Yep, I am. So have you had to be long distance schooling um, alongside, you know, sea shantying? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, I'm working from home as everybody is. Um, I, think, I think I'm on holiday at the moment. I can't remember. <laughs> 
Um, <laughs> one day seems much the same as the next. But yes, initially, um, we had an awful lot of work to do to put together stuff um, to remote, work remotely with the kids. And I've been teaching 33 years, and I've got all these lesson plans in my head, and I've never had to write them down before. So you can imagine how busy I've been over the last couple of weeks. Well, you've really um, earned yeah, your we're rest. Encouraging, we're encouraging <laughs> the kids at the moment to have a break, um, as it is the Easter holidays. So yeah. it will kick off again. Whenever the start, whenever we go back, whenever that may be. Well, you have a break as well, Stuart. You've been Will a busy be. boy, so have a have a rest. Enjoy the sunshine and enjoy some shanty singing. We certainly have this evening. We will. Thank and, you very uh, much. Looking forward to it. On behalf of the boys, we've got um, Abel Seaman, Andrew Newton, Captain Kevin King, Long John, Tony Calladine, Elliot C. Spray, Lee, Kiss Me Harvey, and they call me C6 Stu. But there you go. <laughs> we've got our shanty names. So on behalf of the boys, thanks so much for having us on. Thanks for playing our track. And uh, you're doing a good thing. Keep it up. Thank you so much. Oh, well, no, thank you, Stuart. Put a smile on my face. Thank you very much to you and all of your brilliantly named shanty singers. I'll have a shanty. I know how to say it now. There you go. <laughs> Toodle pit.